How can you classify triangles? Think about this question during the lesson. Triangles can be classified by their sides. Before discussing individual triangles, can a triangle have just one congruent side? No, congruent means that a side has to be of equal length to another side. Thus, a triangle must have two or three congruent sides, not one congruent side. How many equal sides does an equilateral triangle have? An equilateral triangle has three equal sides. Can you draw an equilateral triangle another way? You can only make the equilateral triangle larger or smaller or turn it around. You can't change its shape because you can't change the angles. How many equal sides does an isosceles triangle have? An isosceles triangle has two equal sides. How many equal sides does a scalene triangle have? A scalene triangle has zero equal sides. Triangles can also be classified by their angles. A right triangle has what type of angles? A right triangle has one right angle. An acute triangle has what type of angles? An acute triangle has three acute angles. How can you describe the measurement of these angles? All of its angles measure less than 90 degrees a right angle. An obtuse triangle has what type of angles? An obtuse triangle has one obtuse angle. How can you describe the measurement of an obtuse angle? An obtuse angle has a measure greater than 90 degrees, a right angle. How can you describe the measurement of the other two angles in an obtuse triangle? The other two angles in an obtuse triangle are acute angles. Is it possible to draw a triangle with two or more obtuse angles? No, it is impossible to draw a triangle with two or more obtuse angles. The sides will never meet to form a triangle. Now you know how to identify and classify different triangles.